Mr. President, your testimony is subject to the penalty of perjury. Do you understand that, sir? I do. There was shock in the conservative movement that 12 years of dominance had been upended by the Clintons. Together we can make America great again. Democrats lose elections and they get sad. Republicans lose elections and they get mad. And when they're mad, there's payback. People that I was associated with wanted the Clintons to be brought down on personal scandal. In May of 91, Bill Clinton harassed me on the job. Did you ever ask Paula Jones to kiss your penis? No, I did not. The president is being dogged by a story that won't go away. Whitewater development is not going to go away. There are too many questions and there are too many implications for breaking the law. That's a lie. That's a Republican lie. House Republicans were salivating. This was the next Watergate. He's new chief of the Whitewater Investigation, independent counsel, Kenneth Starr. My view was very simple. This is all about rule of law. They wanted to execute a search warrant on the White House. Starr was out to destroy the president. The great story here is this vast right-wing conspiracy. He knows they're out there to get him. He knows he was being hunted, and yet he could be so reckless. Bill Clinton handed the sword to his enemies. As I passed George Stephanopoulos' office, I kind of looked into the open doorway, and Bill happened to be standing there, and he motioned me in. I don't think my heart had ever beat as fast. Unbeknownst to me, I was on the precipice of the, of the rabbit hole. Did anyone see you go in there alone? Um, any day, any time. I don't think so. Monica, someone has told them something. What does this information about an affair with the President of the United States have to do with white border? Nothing. I was going to the White House in the dark of night to take a blood sample from the sitting president of the United States to compare with a semen stain on a dress of a 22-year-old. This was the people's business in the people's house. We are still 20 years later living the legacy and paying the price for that story. What it comes down to is how does our democracy work? The House of Representatives is exhibiting to the Senate of the United States articles of impeachment against William Jefferson Clinton.